Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is me going with Cube 3 of the Weekly Contest 346. Find the punishment number of an integer. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this problem. So this one can actually be done in brute force, especially if you use a very friendly language. Um, the hardest part about that is doing the math. And honestly, I didn't really do the math. What I saw was that n is equal to 1,000, so I could just brute force it and then um and then do it that way so basically i brute forced it i calculate all the numbers offline kind of and then just do the total right but you can actually do this live uh which i didn't do the math one but i had to code for and this is my code um i did it with d dynamic programming um but really there, there's another way of thinking about it uh, about the dynamic programming is that okay so what's the worst case so in I mean, it's not quite the worst case, but let's say you have a uh, a thousand, uh, you know, i is equal to a thousand. So then i square is equal to um, uh, a million, right? So everything smaller than that is going to be smaller. But but basically, what what does a million mean, right? A million means that yeah, there are you know uh, there's many number of ways to you know. Uh, uh, you know, that's kind of dashes, right? Dashes are, well, maybe not dashes, maybe just underscore, right? So how many things are there in between, right? Or, uh, and there are one, two, three, four, five, six, because there's six things. Um, that means that there are two to the six ra ways to partition this number, right? Uh, and two to the six is, what, 64, right? Yeah, 64. Um, and in most cases, that means that um, everything else is even going to be 2 to the 5th for every other number because, well, there are only 6-digit numbers other than that. And because you're only doing... <clears throat> um, so then for, for each partition, um, and hopefully this makes sense because if there are 5 partition. Um, you could say there's a divider here and there's not a divider here, right? It, and because this binary between uh, each of the the underscore, that means that there are only two to the uh, number of uh, partition ways to calculate it. And as a result, it's going to be 32, right? So, yeah, so two to the fifth times, well, how much, how, what is the cost of doing one partition? Well, two to the, the cost of doing one partition is just the length of the partition, right? Because you just have to check, like, linear in the size of the length of the string, so which is like five, right? And then now you times this by a thousand, and that's pretty much it. Thirty-two times five times a thousand is equal to one hundred sixty thousand. So that's roughly speaking the upper bound of the number of operations that you're doing. Kind of, I mean, it's not quite the number of operations, but it's the number of things that you're doing right and i did i this is my dynamic programming code if you want to see it but you don't even have to do it this way unnecessarily and, and I, I calculated all of them um but yeah but because you could do, do this for each problem and that's only if they run a thousand like the input a thousand a lot um that's going to be fast enough so yeah um hopefully this makes sense and yeah if you uh and yeah a lot of people got this very quickly as a result but yeah that's what I have. Uh, and you could watch me solve it live during the contest. Now. I didn't, uh, okay. Say what? That's more weapon. Some of the intervals of those, what does that even mean? It can be partitioned. Some of such that some of the integer of the substring equals i. The sum of the integer values of those substrings equals i. I say.
Is a medium? It's only a thousand numbers, but a thousand square is a million, so that's six digits, and then you just do a BF on that. Okay, fine. Uh, this is kind of awkward because you would just pre calculate offline, but let's see. Um, yeah. I mean, in theory, it's just two to the six of these or something, right? So, oh. Uh. I should write this in C++, but in any case, uh, Should be okay. Wait, did I mess up? Uh, yeah, okay. Touchpad problems. Mm, that's not good. Oh, this never. Uh... That's also not good. Uh. 
Oops. Okay, so that part is good, but this is gonna print too much. Actually surprisingly uh Surprising that it isn't too much actually, but yeah, okay. Actually, went fast enough that maybe I don't need to pre calc it, but forget about it. You could actually buy navy search and prefix some just but uh but yeah. But I'm too lazy to do that. Shit. I wanna keep this uh just for reference. That's why I kinda Yeah. Even though that cost me like a little bit of time, but it's okay, we're, 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 Debugging anyway. Wait, what? No. Twenty fifty six. Nope. What we'll add? Uh, Fourteen seventy eight, one eighty two. All right, let's go. That was yeah. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about this prom, this contest, everything in between. Uh, stay good. Stay healthy. To good mental health. I'll see y'all later. And take care. Bye bye.